Hi, it's Jennifer from A Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the second. So keep in mind the timing is fluid. This could happen at any time. It could happen in a few days, could happen now, could happen in a week, whatever. So also, not every reading is for you. So let's just see what comes up. What do we have for a message? For the upcoming days. What do we have for a message for the upcoming days or day or whatever it is? Oh, we have one that fell out. Seven of Wands reversed. So the Seven of Wands reversed is surrender. It's admitting defeat, giving up giving up standing down somebody may be standing down from a position walking away let me just get a card to go with that king of wands so this is somebody that is very strong very noble typically um, action oriented, maybe in a position of authority, could be a father figure, doesn't have to be. Uh, this is somebody that is very, very decisive. There could be a fall from power with the Seven of Wands reversed. So I said typically, this is a fall from power though, or giving up, or being taken off their throne, being taken down. This person's been in a tough position, but they're losing their position perhaps. Um, could be dealing, be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or somebody that has a lot of fire in their chart. This is somebody that is very, very feisty, very, very battle, like is has a, a fighter. Okay, we have a fighter here. Um, this person is losing their position, or they're giving up the position, or they're giving up a battle of some sort. Either they're being taken out of the position, or they're giving up the position. This is like, I feel like there's, this has been a tough spot to be in anyway. It's been a tough, it's been a tough position to be in, all right? Something about position, because what, I've said position, what, 10 times? I don't know, quite a few. Um, oh, look at the competition. There is, these are both competition cards, and this person is highly competitive, thrives on competition. So we have a competition here, and there could, and these are both battle cards, and this is battle ready. So I'm not sure if somebody needs to be ready for a battle or be ready for some competition, because there's competition here, and there's battling or fighting. Um, hmm. Four of Cups, not interested, missing an opportunity, mm. not seeing an opportunity. Somebody has been fighting something. They have been standing their ground, not opening up or something, wanting to fight or battling something like that, competing, missing an opportunity for love or for emotional or for happiness. There's complacency here. This is this is tension. It is a I don't know if it's fighting or sparring or a dispute or playing games. I feel like we have somebody here that is leaving the games and the fighting and the sparring and the competition behind. Because you notice this stuff is behind this person. It's like they're leaving it behind. You know, I don't want to fight. I don't want to play any more games. I'm taking action. I feel like we have somebody here that has been in a situation where there has been a lot of competition. There has been a lot of playing games. There's been a lot of fighting. There's been, it's been tough. 
it's been tough and they've been maybe they don't love themselves there could be a lack of self-love or they've been ignoring another opportunity for love or they've been ignored there's an ignored love here okay love that has been ignored whole lot of competition and fighting going on right here okay three of pentacles reversed let's just get one more no togetherness lack of teamwork lack of respect for others somebody's been dealing with a person or people that have not been easy to work with these people it feels like it's people it's been tough really 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 tough ah this is giving up it is i'm not doing this i'm not i'm not interested somebody is giving up and it's like i don't want it i don't want to do this this is dropping out right here dropping out I don't want the responsibility, just not interested. Somebody's not interested in playing this game anymore or competing. And there could be there could be some money issues here with the three of pentacles reverse and the four of pentacles. I mean, did I say four of pentacles, I meant to say page of pentacles reverse, but then what I was doing in my head as I was saying that was as I was adding these. And that's why I said four of pentacles. So I was talking and adding at the same time. Things are not adding up either. Something is not adding up. There's, there's no um, stability here. This isn't stable. There's, there's too, there's, it's very insecure. You can't, there's a lack of togetherness, right? There's a lack of communication as well. A lot of fighting though or strong competition. Um, this is not going down that road anymore. I'm, I'm not doing it, that kind of energy. So not on the same page. If this could be a realization, you know. This is admitting defeat, stepping down, giving up some sort of battle. This, could, this battle could happen because somebody just um, makes a decision to walk away I feel like that's what it is hmm. ah! that's what it is it's a decision to walk to walk away to expand to step into unknown territory this is this is a um, being at that crossroads and choosing to go down another path so there is a decision that is being made in the very near future to give up working or investing in something that just isn't working out. It's not practical. It's not realistic. It isn't. It's not. There's no reason to go down that path. There's no, not even any desire to do that anymore. There's, it's just too much. It's overwhelming. This is giving up. It is. It literally is giving. I give up. It is. It's like I give up on this. And I feel like there's been some sort of competition where, you know, it's been really tough. Really, 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 really tough. This is the moment of decision. Do I stay or do I go? Right here. a dead end the page of pentacles reverse is a dead end and the page of pentacles in reverse is a player and the five of wands is playing playing so somebody has been playing they've been playing with somebody whether in any way that it is they've been playing with somebody that it may be a third party situation with the three of pentacles right there somebody's been playing with somebody and it's not going anywhere whether it's at work or at home or whatever, or with a third party situation, this, this is it, all it is is a game. Or a strong competition. 
There's highly competitive energy here. I feel like this competition is coming to an end, though. We have somebody here that's walking away. They are walking away. Nine of Cups. This is now this is the right now position. Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment, happiness. Going after it. This is wishes coming true, realizing dreams. That's what's happening. Somebody is probably going through a moment where they are realizing their dreams. They want a better life. This person is looking for wish fulfillment. They're looking to have it all. They want to have it all, and it feels like they're going to be taking action to go after wish fulfillment after they have been in some sort of situation where they have been held back. I feel like they've been held back by some sort of player or somebody that didn't want to commit or maybe somebody that was in another situation, but I feel like they're about to give up and take action and go after that wish fulfillment, and it is a spur-of-the-moment decision. It is a spur of the moment decision. Looking at happiness, realizing dreams. This person has been really thinking about it. They've been discontent. They've uh, been ignoring an opportunity for love because of somebody that they've been playing games with. But they see it clearly. They see that there's an opportunity for abundance. They see that there's an opportunity for prosperity. There's an opportunity to have it all. And a decision is really close to being made. There's been some sort of delay because of the games or the competition that has been going on. Two cups. Somebody is going after some sort of partnership. We're going right here. A union. This is a soulmate connection. Perhaps it's a possible soulmate connection. This is a decision. This is a decision. This is a choice. Somebody is choosing. They are making a choice to go after something that, you know, is emotionally fulfilling. This has to do with a partnership for sure with these two twos. Twos are about faith and trust. They are about partnerships, soulmates, unions, decisions, choices, foundations. Somebody is going is has been ignoring an opportunity. If you think about it, take this ace of cups and add to the nine for happiness, for happily ever after, for wish fulfillment because of some sort of I don't know, maybe it's pettiness, maybe it's been a previous fight, maybe somebody was holding a grudge, whatever. Something is going on and there's going to be a change. Twos are about changes as well. Um, we may also have somebody here that has been single, but and they've been but they've been waiting. They've been waiting for, you know, a third party situation to change. And now they've been, they've been ignoring another opportunity for love and they're, now they're going for that other opportunity because they're done playing games with a person that is not communicating, that doesn't respect them. The Three of Pentacles reverse is lack of communication. It's a lack of respect for others. It's not working out with a player, okay? I do believe that a sudden decision is about to be made in regards to a partnership. Somebody has been ignoring an opportunity for love and now they're going to be taking action to go for it. Somebody is going to be receiving a message. It's very spur of the moment. This, it's unplanned. This is like a sudden, it's a sudden decision. A very impulsive. This is person has been thinking about an opportunity for love. They've been ignoring it, but it's like all of a sudden they get this push or something and they decide to go for an opportunity that they were ignoring. They're all done playing games. So anyway, I do believe that there is, you know... An opportunity for 
happiness here, for wish fulfillment, for equality, to have a happy relationship, to have harmony and mutual respect with the Two of Cups. I mean, this is mutual respect where two people actually see eye to eye. Let's make it a little bit clearer. I did get my new camera. I just haven't set it up yet. So that's, that, that's love. That, that is something that can turn into love. If you are in a coupled relationship and you're living with this person, if you're living with them, you know, and you've had some sort of fight or a grudge, things could start to get better. Somebody, I feel like if somebody has been ignoring something, you know, trying to prove something, I think things could get better. There is also uh, somebody that has been ignoring an opportunity for love because they were dealing with a player that has involved them in a third party situation. They've been waiting. Two of Wands is about waiting. Should I stay? Should I keep waiting? No. Do not keep waiting. You are missing an opportunity. This is missing an opportunity for a lot of happiness go for it just do it just go for it stop wasting your time playing games with a player that doesn't want commitment i mean that's what this is up here when there is another opportunity for love that has been missed this is a spur of the moment decision to go after happiness the grass is greener over there you know Going where the grass is greener. Going to greener pastures, right? Where there is love. So I do believe somebody is going to be receiving a message. Because this is a message, even though it's reversed, this is unplanned. It's going to come suddenly from an individual that has uh, been thinking about moving forward. But they haven't been able to because... Of the previous player they've been playing with. Or because they were holding a grudge. Good luck. Oh, by the way, I forgot to tell you that this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot.